What is up guys, it's Awana Turtle and today we are doing a Detective Pikachu opening. Our stuff has finally arrived in the mail just yesterday so we're going to open up that Pikachu folio as well as this Mewtwo GX box. Really excited. I um, feel like I've been watching a lot of content for the Detective Pikachu cards so uh, really excited to get into it. Um, the set is, I guess I knew how small the set was but I guess uh, seeing people opening it reminded me like oh this thing is really small. Um, but either way, we're gonna get into it, so let's do this. Let's get into this. So I thought I'll just open up both products and kind of give you my initial thoughts. So we're starting with the Pikachu portfolio. So, and it does kind of have one of these small binders, uh, which is pretty nice. They are kind of like top loaded. I do prefer the ones that are side, uh, but for something that comes with the box, that's pretty good. And it came with this Detective Pikachu card, which from the movie, which is really nice. And actually this little, bumper sticker kind of thing sticker uh, just came with the, the package I got which is really nice and uh, so I believe this is the code card with that and it came with two movie packs as well as one burning shadows pack and we'll toss in the burning shadows for the episode as well and maybe we'll start with the burning shadows and then wrap up with the detective Pikachu uh, so as far as the overall value I think the other ones are a little bit better uh, although if you do want to for the collectors in you um, Maybe just get, pick up one of these, just so you have that Detective Pikachu promo card, even if it is in the uh, set as well. So, to start things off, let's get into Burning Shadows. Yeah, Fire Energy, Heat More, Alana, Tormenting Spray, Sock, Oddish, Charmander, Meryl, Pan Sage. Ooh, right on reverse, and ooh, we think we got something, guys, that we have. Oh, I thought... <laughs> Oh, that's like maybe, just maybe we have it. Uh, but it is the Alolan Muck Rainbow Rare. Very nice. And uh, oh, getting so excited for Unbroken Bonds coming out early May. We're just under a month away from that. And we're going to open a lot of stuff. <clears throat> going to pull a lot of mucks, <laughs> both of them. And so very good start to this uh, in, in our Burning Shadows pack. And we'll just jump into our second one as well. So, um, so far I'm pretty happy with these products. I do feel like it is kind of uh, temporary, like maybe in like three months from now this stuff will be, ah, uh, yeah, that was that was kind of cool, but uh, I, don't, I don't see it very, very long lasting, the hype around this stuff. And Toxic Croak for the second Burning Shadows pack. Uh, however, for for these uh, boxes so far, I do like them. I will say that. And uh, yeah, so let me know what your own thoughts are. Are you are you hyped about this set? How's your collection coming along of the what, 16 cards? All right, so all the cards are hollow, which is pretty cool. And I believe there is a code card in here as well. All right, let's see. We got a moral snubble. And also, what do you guys think of the CGI work for the movie? Um, I feel like some of them are cool and some of them I'm not too crazy about. So we have an RK9 to wrap it up. And let's just see. Okay, so they do have rarities. So we have three uncommons and then a rare hollow and Arcanine. And then for our second movie pack. And uh, are you guys planning on seeing the movie? Uh, what, what, what excites you about it? I feel like some of the stuff is pretty creepy, like that Mr. Mime, oh man, that, that not gonna lie, that freaked me out a little bit. I do like this Bulbasaur art. A Ludicolo, this one, I do like the card itself. Table service seems pretty strong. And then, oh, that was it. Forget that there's only four cards per pack. Uh, however, since there's only 18 cards in the set, maybe that is somewhat reasonable. All right, so then for the Mewtwo box, this Mewtwo box, our, our card does look pretty cool. Uh, I feel like he's not that strong, but it is a promotional card, so all good. And then for that box, it came with four movie packs, so I definitely think the GX, or yeah, the Charizard and Mewtwo one are the way to go. However, maybe pick up at least one of the Detective Pikachu just for, to complete the set. And I like how it has Burning Shadows, and also comes with Sun and Moon. Um, no XY, so plus one to that. Uh, once again, so I did open up the box ahead of time. And the packaging was very good again, kind of following up from those team up tins uh, where the promo card was safely secured and no damage to any of the stuff inside. So 
Very nice. Very happy with that. We have a Litten, Cosmog, Rogorola, Growlithe. Oh, that's cute. A little Meowth, Croak, uh, Crocodile, and then a Beware Regular Rare. That's okay. If anything, we want to hit something out of our our Burning Shadows pack. And we did get a Rainbow Rare. Um, so when I saw that shine in the corner, I thought, oh my gosh, maybe, just maybe, we're going to get that Charizard. Very happy with the muck though. Um, outside of the Guzma, I think that would be... Oh no, look at this. This thing is so... It's not bent or anything, it's just like a printing defect or something. Oh my gosh, and there's some shine too. Alright, so let's... Uh, this will be very mixed emotions. Oh, I forgot to say, like, um, from the Pikachu folio box, it came with this coin as well. I'm never too crazy about coins, but at least that one's unique. Alright, let's see, we got a Meowth, Stuffle, Pansage, Krogunk, Mudbray, and... Oh, guys, look at this. What is that? And then we have... Ooh! Alright, so, very nice hit. Another Charizard. These... I feel like we keep coming very close. We pulled a Rainbow Rare Muck. We pulled another Charizard GX. Uh, however, I'm not crazy about that little printing defect on the back, but still very strong opening. These boxes have been very good to us so far. All right, and we got four more movie packs. Let's jump into these. Um, I'm not sure if you can hit the GXs in these, uh, but I think there is still like a Mewtwo card we want to hit, a Charizard that we want to hit. And so, Jigglypuff freaks me out a little bit. I do like this Charmander. Lick a tongue, a little, a little creepy. And then, oh, this, I guess this art's not too bad, but some of the stuff in the movie, the pictures, yeah, that's, he's a, he's a little scary. He reminds me of um, the It movie almost. Not not quite as, as overboard as that, but uh, it's close. All right, we have a few more packs. If you do pull something good from the codes, definitely let me know. I imagine it's just ooh okay so we did get the other detective Pikachu yeah so that's one reason why you want to pull at least one of these um, especially if you want the folio and just be, make sure you get the both arts of the detective or both versions of the detective Pikachu card sorry Charizard and Muck all right we have two packs left I feel like this is the first time I'm aware that they came up with like, even though it's really small, a whole set of cards for a movie. And uh, that's pretty cool. I feel like there's a good amount of hype around surrounding this. The Charmander again, and then a Ditto. Pretty nice. This card, um, I, I would have preferred if it said something along the lines of, you just need to have the right number of energy instead of the correct energy, because otherwise I feel like that is not very viable. Although, maybe, I guess that's not really the point of these cards. I don't even know if they're standard legal, to be honest. Alright, for the last pack, let's see if we can't get that. We did get that Pikachu, which is really nice. Now we're just going for that Charizard. I do like that Bulbasaur, Jigglypuff, and then Arcanine again. Looks like he's part of, like, the K9 unit or something. Arcanine unit. <laughs> Alright, so pretty good boxes uh, all around. Um... Let's just see, we go get this nice sticker, uh, the Jumbo card as always for the Mewtwo GX side. And then, so for the promos, we have the Mewtwo GX. Mewtwo does look pretty cool in this movie. Um, this is the Pikachu promo card from the Folio, so definitely recommend getting at least one of those. We pulled this guy from one of the packs, we got both Pikachus. And then for our Burning Shadows packs, we got a Alolan Muck Rainbow Rare. Thought it was a Charizard, and then I thought this one this one was a Charizard. However, he is just the regular Ultra Ultra Rare GX. Still very nice. This art is actually really cool. Um, so we're getting close, guys. <laughs> we're going to get that Charizard eventually, so stay tuned for that. Uh, so there you guys have it. If you enjoyed this content, let me know by hitting that like button down below. And let me know in a comment, uh, what are your thoughts about this set and how's your collection going? Um, my own ratings for both products are pretty good. I would put a slight edge to the um, Mewtwo and Charizard GX ones. There's just a little bit more inside of it. And I would prefer to have uh, the GX card over the alternate art or the alternate Pikachu card, but that's just myself. Let me know if you disagree. Um, so, and if you're new to the channel, welcome, and please hit that subscribe button, bell for notifications, follow me on Instagram, and I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.